They may seem small and innocent, but that's exactly what the military wants you to think. These planes are fast, powerful, and pack enough firepower to take on a small army. If you encounter one of these on the battlefield, you could find yourself in serious trouble. Today we present to you the world's smallest military aircraft. So dive with us into this fascinating world and discover what these planes are capable of. Let's start this list with one of Beechcraft's most popular light attack aircraft. The design of the Wolverine is very similar to that of all the other T-6 series aircraft offered by the company. The wingspan is practically the same, give or take a few centimeters, and measures 33 feet. The Wolverine can accommodate two people and has a maximum takeoff weight of 4.5 tons. When considering the weight of the aircraft itself, the maximum useful load amounts to 1.86 tons. It was first tested in 2015 during the Ample Strike exercise organized by NATO in the Czech Republic. It proved that the Wolverine is capable of performing air-to-ground missions as it successfully completed seven of them. The reason it was able to complete all those missions with great success, get it, is because it is equipped with the Pratt & Whitney Canada PT-6A68 turboprop engine and a four-blade propeller at the front. This allows the Wolverine to reach a maximum speed of 514 miles per hour. Thanks to the four internal fuel tanks, this aircraft is capable of reaching a destination that is almost 2,000 miles away. Hal Tejas Pocket Fire, developed by Hindustan Aeronautics Limited and used by the Indian Air Force, this is a single-seat combat aircraft capable of flying at supersonic speeds. The aircraft made its first flight in April 2007 and entered service nine years later. To date, 32 units of this 43-foot-long aircraft have been built and are in service. The Pocket Fire has an empty weight of 4.45 tons and a takeoff weight of 9.5 tons, including ammunition, fuel, and a pilot, allowing it to reach a maximum weight of 4 tons. The combat aircraft is powered by a single GE F404 GE IN20 turbofan engine, allowing it to reach a speed of 1,380 miles per hour. Thanks to its large fuel tank, the Pocket Fire can reach any destination within a radius of 850 miles without refueling. If you're interested in the Pocket Fire's weapons, it is equipped with Python 5, Derby, or Astra Beyond Visual Range, BVR, air-to-air -air missiles, television-guided air-to-surface missiles, laser-guided KAB-1500L bombs, and has an explosive firing range of 50 rounds per second. And if you want to learn about a small Soviet aircraft that used to catch fire every time it fired its guns, keep watching until number 6. Call it the Vampire, call it the Spider Crab, call it DH-99 or whatever you like, but this was the first aircraft designed by Major Frank Halford that proved single-engine combat aircraft were truly possible. Although this was in the early 1940s when engines were not powerful enough to propel a jet fighter that needed to be really fast, Halford proved everyone wrong. It uses a single Halford H1 turbojet engine later known as the DH Goblin. The design was unlike anything the industry had seen before. There were two laundrons at the back and then you had the egg-shaped cockpit made of wood and aluminum at the front. People thought it couldn't take off the ground, but the aircraft redefined the entire fighter industry. It's as long as two park Volkswagen Beetles placed end-to-end in measures just over 9 feet tall. Some say this aircraft is so small that Shaquille O'Neal could fly it like a remote-controlled plane. Before we continue, remember to like the video so you can keep getting amazing videos like this one for free. An acronym for Advanced High Performance Reconnaissance Light Aircraft made its first flight in 2014 at Wonderboom Airport. After the creation of the Air LAC, it was said that the two produced units would be sold, but subsequently, Paramount Group, one of the two partners, after some years of stagnation and the acquisition of Air LAC by Paramount Group, it was announced that they would continue the production of this light combat aircraft. The Air LAC seats two people and measures only 34 feet in length. The maximum speed of the aircraft is 313 miles per hour and has a range of 1,325 miles, with a service ceiling of 31,000 feet. Ember Super Tucano A29 Designed and manufactured by Ember Defense and Security, 
The Emmer Super Tucano is a special turboprop light attack aircraft currently used by 15 nations and their air forces. Production of the A-29 began in 2003, and since then, over 200 units have been built. Recently, the Nigerian Air Force ordered 12 of these light combat aircraft to be delivered by mid-2021, as it is a low-cost option for some of the low-threat missions faced by these countries. The A-29 is selling like hotcakes, and when you realize it has precision-guided munitions and a maximum speed of 370 miles per hour, countries would be crazy not to buy it. If you want to see the only pair of aircraft on this list that is only 12 feet long keep watching until the end the Soviet Union takes the prize when it comes to making aircraft with a silly appearance this time we're talking about the Yak 15 which looks a lot like the Fargo 9 we mentioned earlier the aircraft was produced in the period between 1946 and 1947 and around 280 of them were built. They used a German Jumo 004 engine, turned it upside down, and converted it from a piston engine aircraft. The main purpose of the aircraft was to be used as a fighter, but the Soviets used it to qualify pilots flying piston engine aircraft and prepare them for jet flight. The fallen NAT aircraft is the most impressive on the list, especially those painted red. The NAT is another aircraft from the past, very popular in the Indian Air Force, and its popularity increased after the Indian Air Force turned Pakistani F-86 Sabre fighters into scrap metal. The aircraft measures 29 feet in length and has a wingspan of around 22 feet. Due to its utility, the Finnish and Yugoslav Air Forces used it in their armies. Don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell. Although the C-17 is one of the largest cargo aircraft in the United States Air Force capable of carrying 80 tons of soldiers, supplies, and ammunition, this miniature version is, in fact, the cutest. We must mention that it does not fly, but it looks like a little puppy with its tiny fuselage, flattened nose, and snug jet engines that make it look exactly like the real thing. Because it's only 32 feet long and 28 and a half feet wide, some have dubbed it the Baby Yoda of airplanes. McDonnell XF-85 Goblin, do you know what a parasite fighter aircraft is? Well, you're looking at one. This is, in fact, the world's smallest fighter aircraft. It was designed to be an integral part of the giant Convair B-36 bomber. The idea was that the aircraft would take off and, in the midst of battle, release a swarm of these little XF-85 Goblins that could shoot down any incoming fighter aircraft. 